Hey guys, this is Jamie Little Tulua Poet Spice and I am here to do another massive haul. <clears throat> I just split it up in two videos. <coughs> uh, one is a bunch of tattered lace and the other one is Ally Express. So, I'm going to go ahead and show you. Oh my gosh. Show you, show you, show you. All right, let's start with some Ally Express. All right, so first I got this die. Now I did not cut this one out, but because I spent like one whole night sitting there cutting out everything for these two Jim videos. So I got this die and I thought I would play with it, see what it's like. Um, although this piece seems a little short, I don't know. Okay, so there's that one. I got this like dragon die. It's got little wings and everything. Um, and so I cut it out and put it together. Now on the website, they have it used like as a plushie, but I just used paper because I didn't feel like doing all that. So I just used some paper that I had in my stash to grape the green and then look at his little wings <laughs> and his little tail. So I thought that was cute and adorable. <clears throat> um, let's see what else. I got quite a few things. So everything's kind of like, wah, wah. All right, so we got this bear. Got this bear die. We actually had a couple. Maybe it was all here. So you had the bear die, and it's got uh, like a little blanket, and then it had a bathtub. Oh, you probably can't see that. It had a bathtub, a little rubber ducky, some shampoo. I think these are, I don't know if these are supposed to be bear slippers or what. Some shampoo, some what there. So that was two sets. And so here's the bear with his little blanket. Now, I need to do some coloring on their eyes, but here's one with a piece of cake and the fork. I love the little fork. Here's one with a little pacifier, a little rag, and his little diaper. The pin is so cute. This is one where it's like rocking in a little baby sling. And then this one in the bathtub, which is so cute. I love it. So what I did for the bathtub is I cut it out twice. I cut it one layer of white, and then I cut it in a, this is actually a piece of gorgeous girl paper, really. And then I just put the, like the little towel over there and have the bottle float. And he's got his little rubber ducky. Okay, so that one, which was like three or four dies, they had this cute little fox, which was adorable. So you can see his little face pieces and so forth. And so he comes out or she comes out looking like that. How cute is that? This is cute. You could use these for little coffee beans. <laughs> Because of the way they're shaped, so you could use them if you made coffee, you know, did coffee card. And it has this little bow, so I gave it to her as the one in her hair. She's like, oh, so cute, little, little, little. No, I didn't do any shading or anything on these because I'm just like cutting them for you to see what they look like. All right, then there was this one, and it's like a little pinafore and apron. So I just cut it out of some scraps, and it's cute because you got your little rolling pin and everything in there. So cute. And so that's what that die looks like. And you've got all those little pieces. And it had these little buttons. So that was cute. Thought that was adorable. Then I got this box. And it says, there's a plate that says enjoy. And then one that says for you. So you can see the box die. And it makes a really teeny tiny box. It's smaller than I thought it was going to be. Which is okay or whatever. So I cut one, and it says for you in the top, and you open it, right, and it's small. And then right here, you have this little slit, and you tuck these inside, and you can stick that little piece in there, right? And obviously, you'd want to put some acetate or something behind there, or even just another piece of paper if you don't want it to like be like see-through. So that was okay. And I only cut the for you just to see what it would look like. Um, did I get anything else from Ally? I did. So I got this teddy, uh, this, it's a panda bear card. 
So I got that. I didn't cut that out because I was getting tired by the time I got to that stuff. Um, I did get this kind of like mechanical steampunky die that looks like this. And it cuts like this, which is here. Maybe if I put it on the back of my hand, which is fabulous. Because y'all know I love my steampunk. So that was gorgeous. And then I think we can go here because I think, oh, nope, we got a little bit left. That's AliExpress. <sighs> here we go. Okay, I told you there was a ton of stuff in here. It's crazy. All right, so this is with that bear and that's where the cake and stuff were. And then this is one of those little kimono girls. And I thought I'd like this die more than I do. So I don't know. I like her little head, but I don't like her little outfits so much. With these big old sleeves. I don't know, but there's the die. Okay. Now, I got this stamp set. And dies to match. Then I got this little shadow box. Which I thought, hmm, that'll be interesting. It's smaller than I thought it was, but I like the size. So I did cut one of those. And I don't know if I put it together right according to the directions. But it's together. So I thought that was cute. And then I didn't cut any of that out. Just that. Okay, so then I also got this die set, which has two panels. Something like this. And some background pages. So I thought that was pretty cool. Alrighty then. Okay. And then I got this one. So this die. And then I cut it out of mirror card and embossed it. And it's fabulous. Can you see the embossing? Now what is fun, if you go through and use your alcohol markers, you can change the color. So there's that. All right. Now I did get some Doris dies. This set was one set. I already have that set. But I got it again because it was like two bucks. <laughs> so, you know, like grass, you know, if you're going to layer up your grass or something, you know, two is better than one. And then they had these, which is a new set that I didn't have. So they had the words, hello, congrats, and thank you. And so I cut those out of some silver. So there's the congrats. There's the thank you. And I like the size and the font. I didn't think I was going to like it, but I do. And then here's the hello. Hello, is it me you're looking for? Because I wonder where you are. And I wonder what you do. Are you somewhere feeling lonely? Or is someone loving you? Now, if y'all know, y'all are old enough, you know who that is. <laughs> hello. <laughs> Anyway, so that's my AliExpress and my Doris dies from Pat Catan's, which is closing. I'm so sad. All right. Now, next is Tattered Lace. Now, y'all know I love me some Tattered Lace. I love it because it's so fabulous. And they have the best detail in dies. I don't care. Hands down, best detail. Okay. So, the first thing... And I got all of the, well, not all of them, but most of these I got on, like, clearance deals. And a couple are, you know, new releases, but <clears throat> it is what it is. So, I got this one, which is fabulous and gorgeous. So, how cute is that? And I cut it out so you could see what it looks like. And it's actually bigger than I thought it was. So, that's always interesting. So how cute, right? Doo, doo, doo. I need to do my winter video. I haven't done that yet. Okay, so there's that in the tattered lace. Then I got this one. This one I got at a really good deal. This Art Deco, you guys know I do love my Art Deco cards and stuff. So I cut one with a black background and red. And I cut it again and it pulls out this part so you can have that part there and then I did it again in the silver love that and like I said you could take your alcohol markers and color it so there is that look at all this mess you see this big old mess okay um next 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 what do we have 
All right, we can do the Dormouse and the Calories. So this was a cute little Dormouse. Now I did not cut this. I think I did cut it, but I don't know where it went because I had all of it out somewhere. But anyway, this is a cute little Dormouse. This was a new release. But it, oh, here we go. But it came with good shipping, so it was like 66 cents to ship it. Yay. <laughs> So that's a cute little dormouse. Now they have charisma so that you can, it's already colored if you want it to. Then they have this die which says calories don't count on the weekend. <laughs> so I had to buy that and it was on a good price. <laughs> so fabulous. So fabulous. Fabulous. Okay. Now, like I said, y'all know I love some art deco. So they had this collection which i've been trying to get since they released it at christmas time a couple maybe like christmas 2017 but i wasn't paying the amount of money they wanted for it no way you must be crazy so they had it on a good deal so they had this one at her and her fat. I'm trying to get that glare off. There we go. So she had this one and her fabulousness. Bam! Charisma cut out with the die. So they had that one. They had this one, and this is the one I really wanted. Get down! Get! Get! Badness. I really thought this car was so cute. Then you have a little cityscape in that here. So I cut that out. Do, do, do. So you have the little frame. And I cut the cityscape out. So you can see that. And I cut the car. <laughs> Look at that. Is that not cool? Cut the car. So there was that one. Okay. Then, do, do, do. this one was with it. So this Art Deco piece is in that. What this does is it's a melded die, so you can put these at certain places and it'll cut it all out. Or you can just leave it there. So then you have these pieces over here. Definitely Art Deco. This one, I loved her as well. She's fabulous. Now, I didn't cut her out yet. And then this one is like a balcony. I thought it looked like a jukebox personally, but <laughs> it's a balcony. All right. So then, now, it came with... Uh, CD-ROM so you get backgrounds and the charisma which these are the charismas so they're blurry when they come out and then what you do is you put your die over it and then it comes out like that so it goes from this to this so it gives you a little wiggle room now I did a tutorial on how to do this so that should be coming out soon. Then they also gave you the Charisma pack. So it was already printed for all those dies. So you could just do that. Okay. Fabulous. Next, I got some tattered lace bells. And the fabulous part about these is look at this mug. Look how big that die is. Right, right. Look at that. So you get all these dies. And they're big all the way down to this so that's fabulous like I said I didn't cut those out all right these were new releases so they had the pressed rose or blossom release and I only got this set they had like three different flowers and some little foliage I'll try and get the glare for you and then I bought the leaves that they had in that set okay now the my favorite they had this, and it is called the Fine Filament. Um, oh, here's those Art Deco pieces, so you can see those. But like I said, I have a video for that. So, this was a new release, and I loved it. There were two of them that I loved, and I was just like, okay. So, you have this. I'll turn it this way so you can see it. It's this really large circles with all this lace detail, right? Now, look how big this die is. Can you see that? See how big that is? It's a huge die. And it's one, two, three, four, five, six. Six dies in there. 
Now, look at it cut out. So here's your base layer. There's another piece of that Art Deco. So you see how big that is? There's the base layer. Here's the next layer that goes on top. Look at all that detail. Now you tell me. Mm-hmm. That is fabulous detail. And then you have your centerpiece. Booyah. How cute is that? And this is even the one I liked. <laughs> Okay, now, I loved this one, and I was like, ah. And so these last two I liked, and I was trying to decide, am I going to just get those? But by the time you get just one, it doesn't make sense. You might as well just go ahead and get the whole set. So it was squares, and you can see the different designs. Now, I didn't cut these two because I really wanted to cut this one. So I didn't cut these two, but you can see how big that die is. It's bigger than my hand, and I got big old man hands. See that? Huge die. This sucker right there is gorgeous. So, I cut that. So you can see that layer. That gives you this one. And then I cut the design work. Look how beautiful and intricate that is. That is flipping gorgeous. And not only that, but these pieces here, you can lift them up a little bit da, 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 and add more dimension to it. So you get that layer. Isn't that awesome? And then I use that center die to cut that piece out because that's what it would look like. And then I cut this out. So you can see that is gorgeous. I love that. Absolutely love it. <coughs> and then when I saw normally, y'all know I'm not a shabby sheet girl. But this piece of lace up in this one was awesome. So you have this. And it doesn't look like much until you see it cut. So you have a big layer, like a big background layer. Then you have another layer that you can put on to put this detail in. Then you have this detail. Then you have this background piece. And then this detail. So look at that. Look how gorgeous that is. That is fabulous. So let me show you. Let me show you. And then this is my last bit. So here is the big layer. Right? So it's this one. It's the biggest layer. And then look at this. Look at that detail in that flip and die. You see that? You see all that? Look at that. Now let me get you close. Now look at the detail on the flowers. What? That is fabulous. So you've got that. Now you've got that other piece. Right? You've got this piece down here. So what you can do is like take this off. So this is the next piece with that cut in detail at the bottom. Then you could layer it like this. Right? So you see that? And then you could go and layer it like that. Now you can't tell me that that is not freaking gorgeous. Not gorgeous, gorgeous. Look at that. And then like if you left this free, that would be like, oh my gosh. You could go back and ink over it. So I'm going to make a loaded envelope for somebody and put a couple of these in there. Uh. So that's so fabulous. That is gorgeous. I don't care. Then here's the other one. So here's that strip, the backing strip. And then look at this piece. So you can layer that. Now you could just leave it by itself, but there's the backing piece for it. What? Now you know that is fabulous. Come on. Come on. Hello. Is it me you're looking for? Yeah, because this is a fabulous die. What? <laughs> oh, my gosh. And see, you could layer that up, too. You could put that up underneath there. 
You would go to town with that. Anyway, so that is my fabulous, wonderful second part of my haul. And I shall see you guys later. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you want to see a tutorial on one of these tattered lace pieces, let me know. And I will put it in the rotation. Bye, guys.